Hey, Raymond, how are you? I'm doing good. How are you, Principal Mickle? Doing well, just enjoying baby time. <laughs> I wanted to say thank you so much for assisting me with the mid-year evaluations while I'm on maternity leave. Oh, no problem. I just need to know what teachers you would like me to observe and what their names are. Well, I thought I would have you observe the lower elementary team, grades one through three. Okay, sure, just tell me their names. Who's in first? What's in second? I don't know, is in third. Mm, yeah, the principal, right? Yeah. You know the teacher's names? I'm telling you their names. Well, who's in first? Yes. Go ahead and tell me. Who? The teacher in first. Who? The teacher who teaches first grade. Who? The teacher in first. Who is in first grade? What are you asking me for? I'm asking you. I'm not asking you. I'm telling you. You ain't telling me nothing. I'm asking you who's in first. That's it. Well, go ahead and tell me. Who? The teacher in first grade. That's her name. That's whose name? Yes. Well, go ahead and tell me. That's the teacher's name. That's whose name? Yes. Well, go ahead and tell me. Who is in first? What are you asking me for? I'm asking you who's in first. That's it. Well, go ahead and tell me. Who? The teacher in first. That's it. The teacher's name in first? No, what's in second? I'm not asking you who's in second. Who's in first? That's what I'm asking you. Who's in first? Now, wait a minute. Don't evaluate anyone outside the team. I'm not trying to evaluate anyone outside the team. I asked you a simple question. What's the teacher's name in second grade? What's or tell me off by the teacher's name in first grade. What's the teacher's name in second grade? I'm not asking you who's in second grade. Who's in first? I don't know. He's in third. Now we're not talking about him. Look, you got a first grade teacher you want me to evaluate? Yes. Then tell me the teacher's name that teaches first grade. Who? The one teaching first. Who? Wait. What's the teacher's name in first grade? What is the teacher's name in second grade? Who's teaching second? Who's teaching first? I don't know. He's in third grade. All right, look. When you pay off the first grade teacher every school year, who do you pay the money to? Every dollar of it. Okay, look. You got to pay the money to somebody in first grade, don't you? Yes. Does she give you a timesheet? Sure. How does she sign the document? Who? The teacher you give the money to. Who? The teacher you give the money to. That's how she signs it. That's how who signs it? Yes. Well, go ahead and tell me. That's it. That's who? Yes. Okay, when you give the teacher the money, doesn't she have to sign the timesheet? She does. How does she sign her name? Who? The teacher you give the money to. That's how she signs it. You just don't give the money to someone without having to sign a timesheet. No, who signs it? What are you asking me for? Now calm down. I'm not asking you, I'm telling you. Well, uh, go ahead and tell me, what's the teacher's name that signs the timesheet for first grade? Well, now wait a minute. What signs her own timesheet? Who signs her own timesheet? No, who signs hers? I'm asking you. When the teacher in first grade gives you the piece of paper. Yes. Now wait. She puts her name on it. No. Who puts her name on it? How? And what puts her name on it? How does the teacher's name in first grade look to you when she signs her name? Who? To you. That's how it does look. How does it look to you? Who? To you. Who? To you. Who? Look! Look. When the teacher signs her name, how does it look to you? Now that's how it looks. Who? Uh, uh, who? Who? 
I'm asking you, what's the teacher's name in first grade you give the money to? Who? After all, the teacher is entitled to it. Who is? Yes. Sometimes her husband comes down and submits her timesheet. Whose husband? Yeah, sure. I'm trying to find out what's the teacher's name in first grade. What is in second grade? I'm not asking you who's in second. Who's in first? I don't know. She's... Third grade. I know. Yeah. You got a support staff on the lower elementary team? Sure. The title one teacher's name. Why? I don't know. I thought I'll just ask you. Well, I thought I'd just tell you. The title one teacher's name. Told you all these teachers' names. All I'm trying to figure out is who is the teacher's name in title one. No. What's in second? I'm not asking you who's in second. Who's in first? I don't know. Third grade. Third grade. All right. You got a lead teacher on this team? Wouldn't be a fine team without a leader. What's the name? Tomorrow. You don't want to tell me today? I'm telling you. Then go ahead. Tomorrow. What time? What time what? What time tomorrow are you going to tell me who the lead teacher is? Now listen, who is not? I'll scream if you say who's in first. I want to know what the lead teacher's name is. What's in second? I don't know. Third grade. Third grade. All right, you got a pair in the room? Sure. The pair's name? Today. Today? You don't want to tell me today? Tomorrow, do you? I'm telling you. So the pair's name? Today. Today and tomorrow's the lead? Naturally. Now you've got it. Now I got it? Hey. All I got is a couple of days on the team. Well, I can't help that. All right. All right. Let's back up. You know that I used to work in registration, right? Now I come to observe the lower elementary team and tomorrow the lead on my team and a parent comes to register her children at Erickson. Yes. Okay. Now when she registers her three students in lower elementary, me being a good administrative assistant, I'm going to want to assign these students to a teacher immediately on the lower elementary team. So the first grader, I'm going to assign him to a teacher. So I assign the student to who? Now that is the first thing you've said right. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Well, that's, that's all you have. That's all I have to do is assign the student to a first grade teacher. Now who gets the student? Naturally. Now you've got it. I assigned a student to first grade. Somebody's got to get the student. Now who gets them? Naturally. Who? Naturally. 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 So I assign a student to naturally. No, 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 no. Naturally gets a student and? You assign the student to first grade. Then who gets it? Naturally. So I assign a student to naturally. No. Naturally gets a student, and then? You assign the student to who? Naturally. Naturally. That's what I'm saying, Kelly. You're not saying it. I said I would assign the student to naturally. No, you don't. I assign it to who? Naturally. That's what I'm saying. No, it isn't. I assign the student to first grade. Somebody's got to get them. So? So who gets him? Naturally. That's it. Okay, now I ask you, who gets them? Naturally. Same as you. Now listen. I assign a student to naturally. You assign the student to who? Then who gets them? Naturally. He better get him. So I assume the so I assign a student to first grade. All right. Whoever gets him, and the second grader goes to what? The final student goes to, I don't know, I don't know follows directions from tomorrow, which is on the lower elementary team. Could be. Okay, so another first grader walks in and I place a student to who? Yes. Why? I don't know. He's in third. I don't care. What'd you say? I said, I don't care. Oh, that's our climate and culture coach. You know what? You can do your own evaluations. I'm done. What'd I say? Okay.
Okay.